you guys might have noticed my last three videos that I just put out were repeats, but uh, they're just shorter versions of that longer video that I put out. Check out the coil cars behind this one. Wow. Escanaba Lakesville Railroad has miles of track in the UP where they store these cars until they're called into service, either to be refurbished or uh, worked on or whatever the case might be. There she is, ELS 501. Got a little wave, a nice engineer there. How are you doing there, sir? We'll get back over here to check out these coil cars. So I don't know if these were stored until they they were needed for service, or maybe they're going to their uh, to the Escanaba uh, service area where they will redo all of these cars, top to bottom, depending on what the order is. They have been pulling these out of storage for about the last month now. I believe these were near uh, the Groveland Mine Spur. What is that one? Wheeling and Lake Erie Railway Company. Bunch of coil cars there, huh? Now we got some logs heading south. And a bunch of empties. I gotta reach over here and start my car. It's a chilly 19 degrees this, uh, what is it, Monday. <laughs> We were supposed to get six inches of snow yesterday. We didn't get anything, nothing. It rained a little bit, that was it. You can go 10 miles west or north of us and they got hammered. Temps are looking good. We're looking at the 40s tomorrow. Oh man, I'm so looking forward to that. Looking ahead, 30s the rest of this week, higher 30s, 40s next week. And that is all scrap iron coming from uh, the recycling plant. Alter Metal, which is formerly known as Snyder Metal in uh, Kingsford. There's Freddy! Freddy! Hope you're doing good there, buddy. Man, thumbs up, guys. Thanks for watching today. Have a great, great day. Go back and watch some of my old videos. I think you'll like them.